This will be my first transmitter test of the Radio Berry. As you can see, it's already mounted here on my Raspberry Pi 4. And this time, I have also kept a fan here and it is running pretty cool. And I have connected uh, an attenuator, 50 ohm characteristic impedance. Because the output is so low, I didn't feel the need for a directional coupler, although I do have a 3 kilowatt directional coupler, but that is, that's an overkill. So I decided, since it's hardly a few milliwatts, I thought this should do. And I have set it at 5 dB attenuation on this one, still just to safeguard. And I have connected it to my tiny SA with 4 markers. And I'm going to test it on all the bands. This is by no means any uh, meant to be a lab test because most people have access to a tiny SA. So this is just to show that yes, we can use the tiny SA for this measurement. And if the intention was to get lab quality results, then I would have used my Tektronix spectrum analyzer. So as you can see, I, have, I do have access to a Tektronix 495B. I would have used this for lab quality, but that is not the intent now. The SDR is now working and it is drawing about one ampere current as you can see here. So one ampere during normal uh, receiving, it's, it averages around 1 to 1.1 ampere at this time. And here is a close up of the connection to the attenuator. So right now it is at 5 dB attenuation. And now the idea is we will go band by band. I'll just uh, test the classic bands just to get an idea as to how the output is. 160 meters. I have set the drive at 50. The difference what I noticed is from 0 to max the change is 1 dBm. That is all. So I have set it at 50 and the attenuation to the tiny SA is 5 dB so there are four markers you can check out the reading there so there are four markers you can check out the reading there now let us move to 80 meter band 80 meter band tune so there we have the readings on the tiny essay. We'll change it to 40 meters. Tune. Go to 20 meters, tune, fifteen meters, tune. Ten meters tune. So there we have it. I think the output is pretty good at the moment. I am not using any low pass filters. It is just the direct output from the radio berry. Of course, I have not done any two tone modulation test or anything uh, of that sort. This is just Aziz carrier output, uh, the harmonics or the spurii, where they stand with respect to the required frequency. Anyway, thank you for watching.